focuses on sealing up or repairing a damaged gut, what we call leaky gut. Let's take a look. Here is a good example of a good, strong, healthy gut with very, very tight colon cells. We call those colonocytes. The average distance there is about one to three microns. To put that in perspective, a red blood cell is about seven to eight microns in width. Now take a look at what we call leaky gut. These colon cells go from one to three microns in distance to two to three hundred microns. So you can imagine the debris that leaks through causing all sorts of immune reactions. There are many well-known conditions that are scientifically documented to be connected to this very condition called leaky gut. Autoimmune diseases like rheumatoid arthritis, a lot of your food allergies, in fact, over 80, 90% of your food allergies are simply leaky gut. And of course, it's a major source of toxicity. What things lead to this leaky gut? Drinking too much coffee, too much alcohol, too much sugar, not enough fruits and vegetables, especially organically grown. Chronic use of NSAIDs, non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs like ibuprofen, Advil, have been shown in scientific literature to be connected and causing a leaky gut.